Hi, this is Aaron Walpin with AWOL Audio here at the Track Studio in Dallas, Texas, and I'm going to show you how to EQ a trombone. Here we have just a clean trombone with any, without any processing. So it sounds good, but we just want to kind of enhance the, the, the frequencies that we think it's really trying to bring out, and we want to cut down on some of the annoying frequencies. First, what I, want, what I hear is um, we don't need any of the really low end stuff, so let's uh, cut some of that. I have an EQ right here. We're going to cut about 70 to 80 hertz. Sometimes what I do is I purposely make it thin, bring it back to, to where it begins to sound full again. So I'm happy with that. We don't need anything lower than this. So then next we can try to enhance it. This is kind of a, a deeper trombone. It all depends too on, on what kind of trombone and what kind of song and what, you know, what they're playing. They're playing low notes or high notes. Um, here it's a little lower, so let's boost some of those fundamental frequencies around 125 or so. That's already a lot better. You can kind of, it's, it's a much fuller sounding, um, thicker sounding. Let's get rid of some of the annoying. There's some kind of splatty sounds um, when, when he hits some of the higher notes, and I kind of want to tame those down a little. We can boost it to hear it. That really eh, kind of sound. So I'm going to cut that down a little. Bring some air back into there. So let's listen to before and after. Here it is before. Any EQ? And here it is after the EQ enhancement here. So, you know, it's all relative. It all depends on the rest of the song and how it fits in. But these are just some general guidelines. I hope this helps. I'm Aaron Walpin with AWOL Audio. Thank you for watching. Bye.